Hi guys, and welcome to another episode of TZ Watch, the show for reviews of the Twilight Zone episodes. And we're now up to the next episode of the original series, Third from the Sun. So here we go, Third from the Sun is episode 14 of the American television anthology series, The Twilight Zone. It is based on the short on a short story of the same name by Richard Matheson, which first appeared in the first issue of the magazine Galaxy Science Fiction in October 1950. It was directed by Robert Albert, and as I've just stated, it's based on the story of the same name by Robert Mathis, Richard Matheson. First aired on January 8th, 1960. Uh, guest appearances. Fritz Weaver as Will Sturker. Richard Andrew, Edward Andrews even, as Carling. Joe, Marco, Joe Maros as Jerry Ryden. Denise Alexander as Jody Sturker. Laurie March as Eve Sturker, and Joanne Evans as Anne Ryden. So a bit about the plot. Will Sturker is a scientist who works at a military base, a scientist who works at a military base, has been producing a great number of H-bombs alongside other staff members who are manufacturing various devastating weapons in preparation for imminent nuclear war, Sturker realises that there is only one way to escape, stealing experimental top-secret spacecraft stored at another base up north. He plans to bring his friend Jerry Ryden, who is trained as a pilot of the spacecraft, along with their wives and Sturker's daughter Jody. The two pilot sorry, the two plot for months secretly supplying the ship and making arrangements for their departure. One afternoon, Sturker engages in conversation with a co worker, Carling, who gleefully tells him that he has heard a rumour the war will start in forty eight hours. Why would that be gleeful? When Sturker voices his disgust at the potential holocaust, Carling is dismayed and cautions him, saying Sturker should watch what he says and what he thinks. So yes, that is basically the gist of this episode. I won't read any further into it in case I end up revealing the plot twist at the end. But I recommend you give it a watch. It's one of the greatest episodes of the series. I said nothing but good things about this episode so far. I shot an arrow into the air. Is the next episode up for review. Until then guys. Thanks for watching.